Yo, what's going on YouTube? It's your boy Ron Trades, and we're back here with another trade video. In today's video, guys, we're going to be doing something a little bit different. I'm going to be doing a basically like a one-year breakdown on my journey. Um, you guys know this is my first year trading Forex um, the right way. And what I mean by that, guys, before I joined, well, I won't say Forex, but before I started trading Forex, like for real, for real, I was in the IML um, I was a recruiter, signing up people, things like that. I wasn't really taking trading serious. Um, so like I said, I left IML around last year, around November, and that's when my journey really started. Like I say, that's when I really started trading Forex, learning about Forex, what is what Forex really is, and who I can learn from, different concepts. So yeah, guys, like I say, I'm trying to make this video as quick as possible. You guys know I do not like to, I do not like to make long videos at all. So yeah, make sure you guys subscribe though, man. We almost at 1,000 subscribers, um, which is a big accomplishment for me. Um, so yeah, guys, like I say, my one year journey, man, like I said, I started learning ICT last year around this time. Um, I learned it. I was learning ICT November last year. I was going hard, very, very hard, guys, like every single day, no days off studying and trying to learn market structure. Like I say, when I came to ICT, I already had a kind of like an understanding of market structure, support and resistance. I had that mindset. So I kind of knew some of the things that he was talking about. So it wasn't like I was, a you know like a freshly newborn baby learning his content. I kind of already knew some of the stuff he was talking about. So that, you know, meshed up well too, guys. Like I say, started learning ICT in November. Um, like I said, I was learning market structure, order flow, liquidity. I was um, really diving into those concepts. I started from his old videos. So for the guys who know, for the ones that want to know which videos I was, I was watching, I was watching his old videos, his old content. Like I said, guys, I was doing it every single day. Like no bullshit. I was doing it every single day, seven days a week straight, all day long, just studying all day, back testing, forward testing, losing, trial and error, which I'm still going through now. But I'm just telling you guys how I, you know, basically... Basically, how I led up led up to create my own model and, you know, come somewhat consistent. I'm right at break even, you know, like I say, my first year. So that's very, very great, guys. So like I say, as time passed going into, you know, this new year, 2022, that's when I really started to, you know, elevate my own model. And when I say about my own model, I started to put my own things inside of my own model, guys, you know, using my own personality. Like I say, ICT content, ICT content is very amazing. And, you know, he has a amazing catalog of videos to go through but i feel like each trader should not try to copy exactly what he do but you know take bits and pieces from it cut take bits and pieces from his content and you know mesh it well and create your own you know model because at the end of the day he's not the one pressing the buns for us we are the only one pressing the buns so we need to be using a model that fits our personality and you know fits what works for us so that's what i've been doing for this whole year man just trying to figure out what works for me Using ICT as that backbone, you know, using market structure shift, order flow, liquidity grabs, things like that. I mean, it's really all the same thing. All, most traders use the same concepts. We all call things different things, guys. So, like I say, this year has been a very, you know, a very good learning experience for me. Like I say, I failed challenges. You guys have seen me. I failed a 200K challenge. I failed a 100K challenge. I failed a couple 10K challenges. But at the end, I passed 10K challenges. I'm still on my phase two of my 200K challenge, which I'm going to be looking to pass next week. I did not trade this week because it was NFP week. I usually don't take trades like that on NFP. I don't think I only took one trade set up this week, which I did post on my YouTube video. But yeah, guys, like I say, um, like I say, man, yeah, one year in this thing is crazy. I have came a long way um, just remembering why I was when I was in IML. I just remember when I was last year around this time. I did not know half of the knowledge that I know now. And I know it's going to be crazy to even look back two years, three years from now, you know, and look at this video and say, damn, we didn't even really know what we needed to know now. So, like I say, we're just going to continue to keep elevating and growing, guys. Like I say, um, I'm only making, like I say, my YouTube channel is not to teach. Um, I want to, you know, like I say, I'm not a teacher, guys. I'm just here to share my journey, share my experiences, share my ups and downs, share my wins and losses, share when things are going bad and share when things are going good. A lot of people can't do that. A lot of people are not real like that on, on YouTube. That's why I feel like I'm one of the realest, you know, trading YouTubers. I, I you know, I, like I say, I'm real confident on that because I show my wins and losses. I'm not trying to sell a course. I'm not trying to sell anything. You know, I don't need to sell anything when you know how to trade. Like I say, real traders don't sell, you know, courses. And I'm always stick on that. Real traders don't sell courses because you're making bank from trading. That's just me. That's how I look at it, guys. So 
Like I say, man, one year into this thing, it's been an amazing year, though. Like I say, I've learned a lot from different people. I've connected with a lot of traders that, you know, I didn't know before trading. You know, they've helped me out with trading. I've helped them out with trading, you know, just basically just meshing our journey together. So, yeah, man, like I say, I don't want to make this video too long, guys. I'll probably go for another, like, five minutes. But, yeah, man, just thinking about the journey and thinking about how far we came, it's crazy. Like I say, at first, I did not know how to trade. I was trading supply and demand. And before I even go there, it's nothing wrong with supply and demand. There's nothing wrong with support and resistance. We all got different concepts. We all see the market a different way. But at first, I was trading just strictly supply and demand last year around this time. And I was trying to use supply and demand with ICT concepts. That did not work for me personally. So I basically ventured away from that. And I started trading um, smart money um, techniques, you know, smart money concepts, um, liquidity graphs, market structure shift, return back to a favorite gap or order block. And yeah, just pretty much using that. That fits me a lot. I can see that really, really well in the market. Um, that's another thing too. I want, that's another thing too. I want to talk about also for any new traders, you know, that's just getting to trade. And please find what works for you. Don't try to find what works for someone else and think that's going to work for you. It does not work like that. Just because something works for, a, a, you know, some other trader and they're making big bank does not mean that you're going to do the same thing. Like I say, what I've what I've come to learn throughout this year is that you must do what works for you and what fits your personality. Because at the end of the day. We are the only ones that's going to be pressing the button. No one's going to be pressing the button for us. No one's going to be sitting in front of the charts reading it for us. So that's why I say you need to find a concept that fits your personality and just fits who you are as a person. And like I say, that's what I have made my goal to do this year. My goal was not to make a lot of money. Like I say, my goal was not to make a lot of money this um, first year. My goal was to come up with a model that I can go into, you know, the second year, my third year, and then start making the bread, then start making the bank. You know, once you got to have that foundation, you just can't get into trading and try to make a lot of money and so you need to have a model that you're confident in, a model that fits your personality, a model that works for you. So, y'all yeah, guys, like I say, man, don't I don't want to make this video too long. This is my first year trading Forex the right way, the real way, actually taking it serious, actually showing up every day, consistent, treating, treating this as a business, treating this as my first and only option to make it out of poverty. So yeah, guys, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video, man. Um, Like I say, just a one year update. Like I say, we a year in, going into the second year, going into 2023, ready to body the markets, Um, coming into it with a different mindset. My psychology has grown, you know, a lot. I understand to be patient. I don't force trades anymore. Like I say, guys, I only took one trade set up this week. You Usually the old me taking, you know, a lot of like I'm, I'm trading every single day based. That's not the way to do it. If you trade every single day, you're basically opening yourself up to losses. So that's why, you know, I'm very proud of myself on that. I'm very patient. I don't rush the market anymore. I'm okay without taking trades. I can get them. To, I can wake up at London session and not even get a setup. And I'll be okay with that because like I say, I've grown to understand that less is more wait on the a plus setups and you know you're good to go so yeah hopefully you guys enjoyed this video um catch you guys next video man next video will be a trading video i will start doing more content different content also um and, you know on the video on me on the channel guys but like i say this video this channel is not made to teach it's only to share my journey and share my process so hopefully you guys enjoy this video make sure you guys subscribe man we're almost at 1k it's going to be very, very great when we hit that. And yeah, thank you guys for all the support once again. Thank you guys for all the love, you know, supporting my journey. Yeah, hope I'll see you guys next video and peace out.